In Madera County, foothill communities leading up to Yosemite digging out after again being hammered by snow overnight. And tonight, a warning from the Madera County Sheriff to anyone who's thinking about traveling in that area. We check in with our Ben Morris now, continue our team coverage from Oakhurst with more on how a group of area residents coming to the rescue tonight. Ben. Yeah, we're here at the Oakhurst sign, and as of right now, we're getting a nice wintry mix of, of snow and rain, but the roads are getting you know, ever more dangerous. And the Madera County Sheriff is asking that if you are heading up towards this way or towards further towards Yosemite, that you stop and think first as they're working around the clock to rescue trapped people in their vehicles. They come out and they get in over their heads and it's a strain on emergency services where we may have that snow cat up really high and somebody calls in with a heart attack or some other critical situation and now that resource is not available for that life and safety issue. If you look around Oakhurst, you can see heavy snow continuing to come down. It's hard even for those used to this sort of thing and can be life threatening. Derrick County Sheriff Tyson Pogue says the storms just keep coming. What's unique about this storm is it seems in the past we get a pretty major storm and then it passes and we have time to plow the roads and get everything taken care of and people have time to resupply. Uh, the difference here is the storms just keep kind of coming back to back to back. To help with the storm and others in the future, a group of hundreds of off-roaders going by 559 Off-Road and Recovery is helping out with rescue and supplies. Their founder, Sean Mecca of Awani, says the group started out being recreational, but now they're helping to save lives. I just started pulling people up, pulling people out, and I was like, wow, there's a real need for this. And to count the number of people, impossible. You know, I mean, just this week alone, my group has probably helped hundreds of people. When it comes to rescues, it's people first, vehicle second. Like I says, if you need them to get you and your car out, they're there to help. We have so many volunteers that are just out there doing it. I mean, some of them, they got to go in groups of two, three rigs because it's just four, five, six feet of snow. I've been on recoveries that have taken 15 hours. You have to drag vehicles through eight feet of snow for eight hours. Mecca says the focus now is shifting towards delivering supplies to people trapped in their homes up in these communities. He says if you'd like to help out by donating, you can find a link on our website, yourcentralvalley.com. Reporting live in Oakhurst, Ben Morris, KC24, Local News That Matters.